firefighters' lives on the line. This is going to shorten my life. From the danger of burning buildings and what happens from years of running into them. They diagnosed me with kidney cancer. But these first responders' cancer claims are being denied. That's disgraceful. They should be covering. He should be get, they, they should be getting coverage in one form or another. Tonight, an NBC10 investigation is finding Philly firefighters are now fighting City Hall. Investigative reporter Mitch Blocker shows us Pennsylvania's Supreme Court is making it easier for first responders to get benefits. Along with fighting fires, Philadelphia firefighter John Narcan is fighting cancer. For 22 years I've been a firefighter and you know the whole goal was to be a retired firefighter. His treatment targets the tumors in his lungs. Think about the worst flu you've ever had with the body aches. Yeah, it's, it's like that on steroids. But for him, there are few days off. He has to keep working to keep his health insurance. Right now, I'm not covered under a work-related injury. Like firefighters across Pennsylvania, Narcan thought getting cancer would get him disability benefits. We all thought it was a guarantee. Narcan and other firefighters thought a 2011 change in workers' compensation law made it a guarantee. Pennsylvania's firefighter cancer presumption law says if a firefighter has four years on the job and takes a physical showing they're cancer free at the time, but later gets cancer, a municipality should assume it came from firefighting. But the city of Philadelphia denied Narcan's claim quickly. It took just 24 hours. Cancer is a common condition that we're all subject to getting regardless of our occupation. Philadelphia's risk manager Barry Scott told us the city initially denies every cancer claim it gets. The city tells us in the last three years it's denied 20 claims. Do you believe firefighters get cancer from firefighting? I believe that's possible. But he says the city wants proof, which is why his office forces firefighters to go to court if they want disability benefits. The city says since 2015, 14 firefighters got an average of $32,000 through this process. Firefighters tell us it's not enough, that they need full coverage to pay their medical bills. I can't speak for the opinion of others. I can tell you that the city is doing the best it can to take care of our injured workers. Some of these people are ultimately going to die while these battles are going on fighting this cancer. Bucks County State Representative Frank Ferry wrote the 2011 law. We first showed the third generation volunteer firefighter this summer how it was being applied in Philadelphia. They're breaking the spirit of it. It would be would be the, the more accurate way of putting it. One of the cases Philadelphia denied went all the way to the state Supreme Court and that decision, it could be a game changer. The opinion is a good one for firefighters. Drexel Law Professor Norman Stein reviewed the court's majority opinion. It should make it easier for firefighters to get benefits. Instead of firefighters having to prove firefighting caused cancer, the court clarified that their employer would have to prove something else did in order to deny the claims. Instead of dragging that firefighter through the mud and through the litigation process, they'll actually just honor the claim and cover the firefighter. That would be what I hope happens. But for now, the Kenny administration says it will continue fighting cancer claims in court, including the case the Supreme Court considered. The administration spokesman tells the NBC 10 investigators until a lower court rules, quote, it is premature and inappropriate to discuss possible changes until litigation is resolved. We shouldn't have to fight like this. And it's that simple. Narcan says he'll go to court if he has to. One day I know I'm not coming home because I know this is going to kill me. For the investigators, I'm Mitch Blocker, NBC 10 News. Firefighter cancer claims are being denied beyond Philadelphia. So far in 2018, the Department of Labor and Industry says 77% of Pennsylvania firefighters have been initially denied disability cancer coverage.